If you're looking to invest in blockchain and aren't interested in pure plays like Ethereum or perhaps Cardano, then here's five stocks with huge exposure to the space that you can invest in today. First up is Boeing, and yes, I'm talking about the airplane manufacturer. However, the company didn't become the world's largest aerospace business without once being at the forefront of innovation. After dominating the world of commercial jetliners, the company has since transcended into a hugely successful defense, space, satellite, and telecommunications giant. The company continues to commit over $3 billion to research and development, a lot of which is invested through its own venture capital arm called Horizon X. This VC identifies startups developing revolutionary concepts and therefore it's no wonder they recently contributed funds to the development of SkyGrid, which is a blockchain enabled air traffic control system designed to track and communicate with drones. The technology was recently approved by the FFA for assisting drone pilots with a better way to record and share data in order to reduce air traffic. When drones start delivering our parcels, or perhaps when we're hopping in flying taxis, this technology is gonna be vital, extremely lucrative, and right now Boeing is the undisputed leader in the space. They've got the tech, the network, and the funding. Next up is IBM, the computer hardware giant struggled to grow its revenue and share price over the past 10 years. However, the emergence of blockchain technology may have just saved them with the company recently posting its strongest revenue growth in three years. IBM has been positioning itself well within the blockchain industry since 2016 as one of the founding members of the blockchain framework Hyperledger. The amount of corporations committed to building the Hyperledger platform has now grown to around 67 and IBM has without doubt been the most impressive contributor to the success of the platform so far. Ranked as the number one supplier of blockchain solutions back in 2017, IBM's reputation in the industry continues to grow and they're now reportedly working with over 200 of their enterprise clients on between five to 600 individual blockchain projects. IBM are clearly seen as a trustworthy figure in the blockchain industry, having recently formed partnerships with governments and healthcare organizations to run blockchain-based digital health applications to assist in the management of COVID-19 testing and the management of vaccination data. These pilot projects are huge auditions for IBM and if they do a really good job at proving the benefits of blockchain technology for things like increased transparency, reduced costs, and maybe greater efficiency, then IBM is gonna be in pole position and be an instant leader in the growing blockchain space. Next up is Oracle with the database giant. Having launched its own proprietary blockchain in 2018, the offering is very similar to IBM's cloud blockchain hybrid product, but they're perhaps more focused on supply chain improvement. Back in 2017, I went to a blockchain convention in Amsterdam and I met so many great people, including a group of German guys who had just raised over one million pounds during an ICO for a supply chain project aimed at the shipping industry. It doesn't sound like the most sexy use of blockchain technology, but they were clearly onto something because having done some research for this video, I looked into Oracle's current blockchain efforts and it turns out their most successful project right now is their global shipping business network, which has grown to around 300 customers within the port operations and shipping container industry. Fourth on the list isn't a tech company at all, and that's pharmaceutical business Novartis. The drug maker is a leading member of Pharma Ledger, which is a blockchain consortium in the EU, and along with the likes of Pfizer, AstraZeneca and AbbVie, they've committed to a three-year project where they aim to build a scalable blockchain platform that can be used by all pharmaceutical companies in a bid to revolutionize the industry. Not only were Pfizer, AstraZeneca and Novartis quick to react to COVID-19, having brought vaccines to market faster than pretty much all their peers, but it looks like they were quick to spot another opportunity with blockchain technology. Novartis has also partnered with pharma giant Merck and the University of Madrid to build a blockchain solution or an app that's designed to target counterfeit and black market medicines. Last on this list is US investment bank JP Morgan, because back in 2020, they released their own blockchain powered digital currency called the JPM coin, which is essentially just a stable coin pegged to the US dollar, designed to improve transaction times between banks. Essentially, they're trying to rival Ripple's XRP token as the successor to Swift payments and a means of sending money instantaneously and at the moment, JP Morgan's JPM coin is being explored by around 400 or so of their institutional banking partners. And the bank recently formed their own internal blockchain division called Onyx, 
which is reportedly hiring hundreds and hundreds of blockchain specialists to begin commercializing that technology and start bringing more products to market. So there you go, five companies that are making pretty big movements within the blockchain industry. And to be honest, most people just aren't aware of it. If you keep your eye out for the products that I mentioned above and you start to spot that say one or two are really taking off, then that could signal a huge buying opportunity. In fact, realizing the potential of a product and then investing in the business behind it before the masses is without doubt one of the best ways to make money on the stock market. Whether you were an early subscriber to Netflix or you were shopping on Etsy or perhaps even using Shopify for your online business, these are all excellent opportunities for you to invest in products that you understand and that you believe in. And that's really the key to making money on the stock market. That's it for now. I managed to go five whole minutes without asking you to subscribe. But if you enjoyed the video, then please tell me it will take you five seconds, whereas this took me most of my day. And I really do love reading the comments, but if you don't have five seconds, then just click the like button and subscribe, and I promise I'll keep posting these videos for you. Lastly, but not least, remember, your money should be working for you and not the other way around.